My name is Chad McGehe. I'm from Wichita Falls, Texas, and I'm the Chief Technology Officer. In Wichita Falls ISD, we have 14,100 students. Um, the biggest challenge we've had in the last few years is funding. Uh, how do we have devices for that many students? Um, Chromebooks and the price point that they represent uh, help fill that gap for us. Um, and the fact that Google Apps for Education is free and that Google gives unlimited storage for students and teachers, uh, that helps alleviate some of the funding issues that we've had. We started in 2015 uh, with a digital classroom pilot with 42 teachers, uh, range from kindergarten through 12th grade. We gave them several different devices. We let them use them for six months and then brought them back together and asked what issues they had with them, if, if any. Uh, some of the issues were lack of keyboard, um, app purchases, mobile device management, randomness, uh, frequent updates, login times. Uh, but the users that had Chromebooks, uh, they just said, you know, whatever you do, don't take them away from us. Before that, you know, we had spent plenty of time looking at um, some sort of classroom software. Um, and Google happened to be coming on at that point and making a big push. And the price was right. It was free. It was easy for them to use. Uh, it was unlimited storage. Uh, so all of those things helped make that decision that much easier for us. Once we chose Chromebooks as our device and Google Classroom as our platform, we brought those teachers in and we gave them basic training on Web 2.0 tricks, uh, screencasting, and then we had them meet with our instructional folks and we rewrote everyday lessons to incorporate technology into those lessons. And then we also wrote expectations for them as far as what they needed to be incorporated into their lessons on an everyday basis for the first six weeks of school. And then they slowly built. Our discipline referrals and those digital classrooms um, have cut significantly. Um, the kids are more engaged. Um, as far as results, we have several math classes that uh, before textbooks were taken out of the classroom that they were at you know, 91% on the average pass rate for the class. On the last two years, they've grown from 92% with Google Classroom to this last year, 100% of those kids passed the state test. Um, we have a cosmetology class that before Google Classroom was, was presented to them, they had a 73.5% passing rate. And then one year later, um, with Google Classroom Incorporated, they were able to raise that three percentage points as a whole. 